this real, this real shit deal with it. Yeah. With it. <laughs> hey, it's Jay Diggs and your boy number two. And man, this is wild. We got a guest again for y'all to be. I'm this motherfucker, man. Oh, you hear the voice? Hey, hey you get these. Voice of the Southeast. Yeah. PA Go. Hey. The bricks to the sticks, nigga. Oh, Chris Lewis Show. Hey. Hey. PA Go. Hey. Uh, we on the Chris Lewis Show. Oh, shit. Uh, Look, I'm gonna tell you right now, man. You, you got me. You playing my music. We smoking weed. You gave me some alcohol. Yeah, I'm doing great right now. We ain't gotta put them both in rotation. We can smoke them separately. We ain't like it. Y'all got my shit though, right here. We throw 50 dice. Yeah, man. Uh. Oh. 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 All the memories and think about who could fuck the baddest bitch. Hey, shout out to my nigga J. Dot Scott, man. Um, behind the scenes, a lot of niggas don't know this nigga had a lot to do with uh, the video being done and being made and yeah. being paid for. Cause I really didn't have like me, don't man's my partner, but he charges me top price. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, like he does not yeah. play around about that shit. So uh, oh no man, he's running a business. Big man. shout outs to my man J J Dot Scott, man, because he really uh, stepped up and um, helped me fund the video. Man. Okay, so big so. shout out to that guy, man. Oh, you know what? When this shit dropped, when you put this shit on Facebook, like, <laughs> I swear to God, I listened to it three times in a row. Yeah. I was like, 50 dice my side of the, you know, the, yeah. the yeah. fucking city. Son, yeah. This, yo, this is the first time I'm listening to it, so I was like, yo, I gotta find some music, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. See what's going on. Yeah. Found, this just the first one I found, I was like, yeah. And once I started doing some little, some little Uzi shit like that, <laughs> I was like, oh. What's your shoulders start moving, bro? It's a hit. Oh. It's a hit. It's a hit. Yeah. 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 Then he said, he was like, yo, yo my boy Kelly out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Kelly. <laughs> yeah. 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 Kelly like, you know what I'm See, this is yeah. the thing right here. I listened to the, the Chris Newman show recently. Uh -huh. Yeah. And if you don't know who Newman is, <laughs> right. like, listen to that album, son. Yeah, yeah. And when it comes on, I'm laughing. I'm like, mm -hmm. oh, this nigga, he always says some dumb shit. And then when the songs start dropping, the shit he's saying, I've never heard a local rapper yeah. spit shit. And yeah. I'm like, I know what he's talking about. Right. The prospect, the fifth and ninth, oh, yeah. 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 the third. I'm like, yeah. yo, he's yeah. speaking to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I know this shit. Yeah, that's what that's what makes it so beautiful, man. Because um, a lot of rappers, man, they make it relatable to just them. Like they make it, yeah. they they make this uh, this life for themselves that they see. Yeah, uh, I like to paint a picture that you're gonna see no matter where you at. You know what I'm saying? Um, a nigga in uh, Brunswick, Jersey, does not know where Fifth and Dice is, nor has he ever been there. Exactly. But he know a block that reminds him of that. Niggas that I'm talking about reminds him of a block that. You know what I'm saying? So it, I always, I'm the most. You never gonna meet it, it. But it's between me and Baby James as the original Charlottesville. Hey. Like I love it here, nigga. Like me and him actually got a slap box to see who's the king of the bill. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? And I would lose because it's baby James, baby. baby. Ain't no way I'm gonna beat this nigga. So oh, it's like, uh, wait, hell no. But I'm, uh, you know, stuff. it don't get more Charlottesville than me, but I always thought outside the box. You Real know what shit. I'm saying? I tried to, and you know, I tried to incorporate being a lyricist, being a comedian, and being an entertainer, and putting it all in the one spectrum, and just making that shit work. And so far, the shit. I mean, well, we gonna give you your flowers that. today, bro. Right, right. Bro. Thank you. I appreciate. I'm letting you know. I've been knowing you for a minute. You one of the few niggas that no matter when or where I see you, yeah, I know I'm gonna get a good laugh. Yeah, I know it's good energy. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And uh, 
I don't know what's going on with one on one three, but uh, yeah, man, they so really it's... dropped the ball on this one. That's what I said. What's going on with that joint? <laughs> I ain't heard that shit. this nigga. Yeah, I definitely ain't tuned into that shit. Yeah, I ain't listening yeah. to shit. Yeah, my um, girl the other day was asking. I mean, me, like, yeah, what before you, you before you answer this, before yeah. you answer this, yeah. can you please? Yeah. Just hit that little joint, yo. It's the mouthpiece. Uh, you're South now East rocking with the mouthpiece of the southeast, the voice of the veil, the man of the hour, your best friend, your boy, boy, your wingman, the pal to take you on a flight, the conductor to take you on the voyage, the guy to take you on the ride. My name's V.A. Doe, man. Most famous motherfucker ever. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> but, uh, you know, and that's what it's about, man. You gotta make that shit memorable, or why the fuck are you doing it? You know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's a lot of it's a lot of things I can say about doing radio, but... Hey, just real quick, real shit, deal with it. Deal with it. Yeah, uh, a little technical because we ain't gonna talk about it, but you know what I'm saying? We keep that in a little, 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 little meat. Yeah. Um, <laughs> heard what I said, I said what I heard. Oh, that's more dope. Where that little tray at? Yeah, let's get, let's get higher, man. It's CBD, by the way. We don't want fucking know no more, no carpet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah all CBD. It's, it's, it's real. Okay. <laughs> Cause I don't want us. <laughs> now I know you know what? I bet a nigga the nigga sold me that shit, yo. And I was like, yo, why does weed taste and smell like pineapple? Oh my God. Fuck. Like be the most disappointing shit. Like I'm like, nah, it's like red niggas like, oh, cause that's that fight. No, no, it's yeah, like, I don't like literally I don't yeah, like a fruity yeah. weed. I like yeah. Weed, dang. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I like yeah. motherfucking like some side diesel, old side diesel in the tan. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? When it's $20 for the point five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. I remember yeah, those days. When yeah. uh, Hydro first came on the scene. Oh, oh my God, yo. Couldn't tell us shit. I was driving down. I smoked some of that shit. I was driving on 64 and I was going 25 miles an hour. <laughs> and I was just like seeing water, like waves. I, I don't know, my psychologist is going to get geeky. Psychological, that motherfucker fucked my brain up. Y'all know the Bro, problem. I'm pretty sure that was PCP. <laughs> 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 I'm pretty sure that was something else that you got you on the joint like Snoopy. I knew it. I knew it was some water. I said, I'm drowning in it. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember that white widow we smoked? Oh, we ain't gonna discuss that. Yeah. We gonna put that in the vault. Yeah. Like yeah. That. Uh, I, I knew a nigga. Uh, I'm only going 45. I knew a nigga that. Slow down, Gary. You ever heard of a uh, uh, scissor sap? Scissor sap. Scissor sap. No. So when the dispensaries are cutting the buds off, right? The scissors get like a buildup of like you know what I mean yeah. THC and shit, and pretty much sap from the tree. Yeah. And they would scrape it off. And like preserve it and like smoke it. And I guess my boy had, he was real cool with a motherfucker that grew his own shit. And we would get scissor sap, yo. And when I tell you that was the greatest experience of marijuana I've ever had in my entire life. Like, first of all, it was the first time, you know, when you remember the pins when the pins first came out? Yeah. And you would hit it and be like, this ain't shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. it was like that, because I would hit it and my lungs wouldn't even know I'm smoking, bro. And I'd be like, I'll hold this shit and I'm like, I don't feel it. Oh, shit. <laughs> and it would just hit me, like, after the fact. Yeah. Bruh, niggas would sit there and play zombies for hours, bro. Yo. And just, like, drooling zombies. high. Nigga. Yo, I remember the first time I got high. Like, because, you know, when you first smoke. Yeah. It, it just don't unlock like that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You be like, man, I ain't high. I ain't high. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. I remember the first time I got high. This is real quick, real shit. Deal with. Mm. Got story time. Mm. Got a story to tell. First of all, the nigga Terrence. I was with this nigga Terrence. You know Terrence Smith. Yeah. Um. I was with that nigga, and we met these white girls. You know what I'm saying? I had this white girl oh, at the. Uh, shit. At the uh, fucking with the white girl. Terrence is gonna love the fact you oh, told this story. Nah, he, 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 <laughs> I mean, He's he was with me with this white girl. Oh, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Because okay. we met her at Aha. Uh, it was with right. the Aha uh, This was oh, your man. master poet. Okay. Yeah. Got so you. you know, he was just running with me. You know what I'm saying? Got Back you. in the day, I'm 18. Yeah. I'm 18. It's October 1st. It's the first time I smoked. Then I give you the first time I got high. Okay. Uh, first time I smoked. 
the white we pulled up in the um in the where uh Barris Road at with a Kroger at we pulled up in the parking lot right there. She, we Terrence had Terrence had a big ass cigar. He he fucking with that shit, like smoking that shit. I pulled up next to her. She smoking a little um little joint. You know what I'm saying? So she was like, you know what I'm saying? You hit this, I hit that. I was like, bitch, you ain't gonna hit this. This shit'll kill you. Cause I'm still yeah. young. I'm like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? You spit in hell, motherfucker. Like, God, you gonna die. I'm yeah, gonna fuck yeah, what you yeah, said. That's yeah. my mama said. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, you know what I'm saying? So, so she was like, yeah, I'll hit it, baby. I'll hit it. Give it here. So she hit that motherfucker. And then Terrence was like, you gotta smoke it now, Jay. You got to You wanna be the idiot anyway, motherfucker. Yeah. Gotta smoke it now. So I hit that joint. You know what I'm saying? As soon as I hit it, whoo, cops came. I was like, oh shit, this ain't meant for me. God, I knew it was a sign. Then I just was like, fuck, they pulling up. So I was like, I gotta think of something. I said, she, you know what she did? She pulled the fuck off. I, you know, I had a thick pass on my feet. I said, hey, I'll call you later. i call you later, all right? And the cop looking like, oh, you just trying to get some pussy. You know what I'm saying? Uh, then I pulled the fuck off. I'm driving down 29. I didn't know if I was high or not, but I was like, Man, something ain't right. I'm saying yeah. water. So I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> you keep saying water, no, nigga. I say, I say, I'm drowning, nigga. Uh, all right, so then, all right, next time I get high, I go to her house. She in Richmond. She a VCU student. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's, I walk in the room, let this go some coke. I said, God damn, what kind of party is this? Yeah, she turns up real fast. That's yeah. game rave drug my ass. Like, man, man it's a to I thought you worked at IHOP. You no, know, I was like, so, so. That's how she worked in my house. Yeah, and, and she worked in my house. Now, now I just associate all waitresses with cocaine. <laughs> cocaine and Adderall. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, all right, boom. Anybody chilling out watching TV and shit, watching some, listen to some crazy shit. You know, white people listen to some crazy shit. Yeah. That's on. Yeah. Winter's in your eyes. <laughs> I'm going to say I want to fuck your asses. You know, yeah, there's crazy shit like that. I was, that was catchy. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was right. hard after six right. times. You fucking a bitch six times. So anyway, all right. She got this mother, she said, you want to get high? I was like, yeah, fuck it, let's go. I said, I ain't never been high before. That shit really don't work on me. She said, you ever had a gravity bone? I said, what the fuck is that? Uh -oh. yeah. She That's said, dude, person, person. I got one. You want to do it? I was like, man, I don't know. Then I was like, fuck it. So she pulled out this motherfucking cooler. She had water all the way up in it, about halfway. She cut a motherfucking two liter jug in half. You know what I'm saying? And she already had the cap joint ready with the little yeah. thing thing in the bob yeah, right there. Yeah. Made from previous times. Bro, bro. Yeah. She was a pro. She was a pro. Yeah. Not slow. She put that joint on there. So she she put it all the way. She put the uh, weed in there and shit. Put the cap on in it. Put the bottle all the way up in there. You know what I'm saying? To, you know, all you know where it can, as far as it can go. Then she lit that motherfucker. When she lit that shit, she pulled it up real slow. Mm -hmm. When she did that shit, it was just getting milky white. Yeah. Milky white smoking that joint. Uh -huh. Milky white. She said, all right, you ready? <laughs> it's time. Oh, like, God damn, nah, baby, I ain't ready. You know what I'm saying? Oh, what I got to do? What I got to do? All right. She said, yeah, when you screw it off, just, you know, Put your mouth on it and just, when you, when you go down, just inhale. I said, oh shit. I said, word. Hit that, that jaw. Pause, that look kinda weird. <laughs> Hit that jaw. <jaw. laughs> I'm rolling around the floor like a dog. Just rolling around. <laughs> oh, oh, oh shit. Shit. And then I sit on the couch, she's like, you okay? I was like, yeah. She said, you feel it? I was like, no, nah, I don't feel nothing. She said, you feel this? She started rubbing my dick. <laughs> I said, yeah, yeah, I feel that shit. Yo, I was so high and like everything was just moving and feeling good. She grabbed my dick, nigga, I was like, ah! <laughs> that shit's sweet. I was, I was really down for that story till it got sexual. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Once it got sexual, I was like, all right. Got, I mean, that's where it went, though. That's how it went. <laughs> she unlocked my high with the gravity bomb. We all knew the story. We all knew yeah, that yeah. in the in the, the story, she was gonna be sucking your dick. We knew that. It was, right. We didn't have to like. It was like, why girl gravity gotta, because, bomb? There's a low job in order. It also moves into you know yeah. you know you know. Like, so yeah. Yeah. It's a natural effort. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, that is a fact. Mary J. That is a fact. White people are very very creative with ways to get high. Right. Yeah. And still in black culture. It's really dope how they are able to, <laughs> you know, <laughs> just take a fucking can and, you know, light up some fucking weed. Like, who the fuck thought to do the apples? You know? <laughs> Like what the fuck? Dude, I got an apple. Yeah, oh, that's all I got. Yeah, and it's 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 and uncanny why? how how they're able to do that as well as you know look like black woman. If you have nothing else to smoke out of, why do you have an apple? <laughs> like, Seriously. are your priorities in straight or not? Like, make up your fucking mind. So you carry this apple around, but you ain't got nothing to roll that shit. Yeah. Out. That's fucking crazy. I smoked out of an apple once. Uh, I was at, oh, was it? I was at I was at Empire State Games. I was there. We found some weed on the street. We didn't have nothing to smoke out of. Yeah. <laughs> Get invented. Nah. Said so, uh, found some weed. What's the? I'm trying to think of what's the dumbest. That'd be, that'd be thing. I think the most desperate shit I ever did, and I didn't have a blunt, was probably think that I could put weed in a cigarette. And like stuff the cigarette properly. <laughs> How'd that turn out? I always wanted to try. It. Yeah, please let it, us know. It, it, um, I don't know. Maybe I didn't do something right. This wasn't the time when we could YouTube things. Yeah. So, I mean, I knew that I had to grind it up real good because right. you know what I'm saying? I knew that. You know what I'm saying? I knew I had to be very delicate with the stuffing of it. Yeah. But yeah, it just didn't fucking work out. <laughs> it ripped. It, of course, of course, it fucking ripped rip. like a bug. Ripped like a fucking. Head. And honestly, I felt like such a fucking dickhead. Like, yo, I fucking hate my life, yo. <laughs> <laughs> like, it got real depressed. It was. Those were dark times, man. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dark times. Oh eight oh nine. Oh eight oh nine ish, man. Yeah, my, that was a dark time for everybody. You know, my, everybody was going through. I it, know. My dark period was a nice little run, yo. Like I've actually just now snapped out of it, to be honest with you. Yeah. Like for real. Like shit's been rough. And it's honestly, it dates back to you think about, you know, what I had to do to like be dope. You know what I'm saying? Like for yeah. so long, bro, I was like different, my nigga, like we grew up on top of the hill together like the niggas i was around i won't own the shit they was on you know what i'm saying yeah. like back then bro if you won't down the jump crackheads bro like why are you <laughs> with us and i'm like bro i just don't get anything out of that why are we beating this man is he already fucked up he smokes crack yeah. not only did he not get high but now he needs aspirin because we just beat the shit out of him damn fuck man like god damn so he <laughs> three dollars for the that's some real shit like for real like i just wasn't into that shit so i was different bro in my era bro it was not cool to be a rapper that shit was not cool, my nigga. Like, if you was a rapper, like, that means you're not a drug dealer, which means you's a bitch. Like, <laughs> for real, my nigga. So, like, I had to not only write dope raps, but, nigga, I had to learn how to fight, too. Because it's like, niggas gonna pull up because I'm not trying to do what they trying to do. So, for so long, I would look at who I am and how I am and, like, hate that shit. And it's like, oh... Fucking hate being like this, and you know I would try to be like niggas. I would try to do shit that I see niggas doing, and this shit would yeah. never work, my nigga. I sold crack for like three weeks, my nigga, and then <laughs> got a a crack charge, nigga. Like it did not take long. And then let me tell you, this is a crazy story, nigga. I was fucking I this one. I was Nino fucking Brown out here, boy. <laughs> let me fucking tell you, nigga. It wasn't yeah. a good three weeks. It was a good three weeks, man. I would flip those hundred dollar wholesales so lovely, and it's like it's not weed, so I'm not smoking it, so it's not really going nowhere. Yes. New pair of Jordans, here I come! Like, nigga, I just knew this shit was gonna be dope, bro. And I never forget. I caught my, and the funny thing is, my mom had this great idea. She was like, "Look, son, check this out. We're gonna move from Prospect. Wait a minute." 
<laughs> to Tiffin Page. How does that sound? You like that? Yeah! You're going to Tiffin Page. You're going to Tiffin Page. Don't be dubs, son. Don't be dubs. You're from the coast now. Oh, and I'm like, Mom, I'm page. going to get jumped. Like, <laughs> I just got finished getting jumped over Prospect and I jump at Crackhead. So fucking stupid. Back then. <laughs> now I gotta deal with this. So. Shout out to my nigga Bummy, shout out to Stefan, Mark Marsh, you know what I'm saying? My nigga Eric Jones, they fucked with me tough. Right. And like, they, they took a nigga in over there. Like, you know what I mean? They showed me love. So I would get what I needed from the spec, and I would come back over there, and I would think I would have the upper hand, because I'm not fucking with these other niggas. And I'm not getting pushed up on for not fucking with them niggas. Like, I'm like, oh, I got this down to a science, I'll be great. So I had got some shit from the spec. It was such a popping week. I like pretty much got rid of everything on my way home. I didn't even make it home. This was back when crackheads like, hey man, you got something? You got something? You got something? <laughs> hey, 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 young brother. Hey, brother, you got something? Do you have crack for me? And I'm like, sir, I'm 13. Let me go. <laughs> like, so, like, nigga, I'm definitely, I sold just about all the crack. <laughs> this is how great a deal I was. <laughs> Almost so all the crack by the time I got back to 10th and Page, I had one rock love. I put it in my fifth pocket. I had my whole like in the drawers compartment. I had that. But I sold everything but one joint. Why well, am I gonna go all the way in here for one little joint? Put it in my fifth pocket. Hours go by, my nigga. I totally forget I have this shit in my pocket. <coughs> Police pull up on me. I'm like, get the fuck out of here. I ain't got nothing but money in my pocket. They're like, oh, what's this, sir? And I'm like, man. I'm like, I'm going to jail. I heard jail. that story from a lot of people, too, yo. That damn fifth pocket, yo. <laughs> I'm, go I'm going to jail, ain't I? they like, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah, man, so... I snitched on like 12 niggas, got out, and then here I am, baby! I'm glad you made it! I'm glad you made it! I'm motherfucking Mr. Kashi! I'm kidding, I didn't say it. It just sounded like the funny thing to say. Oh, shit. I oh. actually, uh, I don't know what you mean, though, because I, I had a nigga back in the day try to get me to sell some work. But, uh, my mama being who she was. Right. I straight declined. Yeah. He tried to make it sound good. He tried to, you know, yeah. you know, you know, I give you this, you know, you can bring me back this much, you keep yeah. this much, you know, that's a new, you know, pair of shoes, yeah. new this, that, that. And who wouldn't take that off of? I mean, good. nigga, only thing I really like was cartoons and video games. <laughs> so, nah, That's a fact, bro. I'm good. I'm good. That's a fact. Yeah. That's a fact. That it's, was my route. So. It's not. It's not for everybody, yeah. bro. And I, I feel like it. today's kids aren't embracing that, so they're doing it and they're getting caught and they are becoming rats because they doing a crime and no one told them, "Hey, you also have to do the time." Like, you know what I'm saying? There's some young niggas out there that's really built on some real shit. You bro? There's some young niggas that's built on some real standards, though. But it's also some that don't give a fuck. Yeah. About nothing. There's no code. It's just whatever, nigga. If I could get it in blood, like you know what I'm saying? Man, it's a bunch of goofy niggas. Yeah, yeah. So you got questions for me, man? Yeah, yeah. I like, yeah. I like being interviewed. Yeah, this I got another fun. question. Yeah, I got another question. I like these. And it just, it's just so, so much common. We, have, you know, yeah, we got so much in common. And we I'm never sure. like crossed each other's paths. That's shit, the weird yo. shit, yo, man. I just seen some. I don't know where I seen it at, but and I know some things. Okay. I know you think it's gonna be a zombie apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is what I know. You know what I'm saying? I know you ready for that shit. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I've been looking for niggas that's ready for that okay, shit. Okay, okay. I mean, you, you're speaking my language. We got to stick together. That's right. And that's I right. also know you, you, you've you been fucking my bitch, too. <laughs> oh, shit. I know you've been fucking my bitch. <laughs> Yo, I knew this was a fucking... Uh, I knew this was a fucking... No. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sure. uh -oh. You know who she was? Who, who she Motherfucking Michonne. 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 I'm walking dead, nigga. Oh, you <laughs> fucking dumb ass. Yeah. Literally. I know you fucking my bitch, because I named my truck Michonne. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Because oh, she a God. black bitch. I ain't gonna say it like that, but <laughs> you bad black bitch. Is she a bitch. baby? Not only did you just say it like that, you accused me of fucking with her, too. I didn't know. I, I was like, I knew this was an ambush, man. All my hoes gonna come out. You 
I'm scared to, bitch. I'm scared to do other niggas shows, yo. This is not in my control. I love it though. <laughs> but no, I liked Michonne. Uh, uh, she was not my favorite though. My favorite was uh, I like the Puerto Rican joint, but I really, really had a thing for uh, the Asian kid's girlfriend. Especially after that nigga died, like oh. she was so hard, bro. Oh, like, yeah. I forgot that bitch name. I stopped watching it yeah, so long, I forgot too. that bitch name, yeah, bro. Yeah, but nah, I love that bitch, yo. I low key loved Rick, Rick's wife too, cause she was such a low down dirty slut, yeah. and I loved it. I loved every <laughs> minute of it. Yeah, yeah, go to her son. Yeah, and then like she, they were her, her dead husband back. I'm like, oh, I bet you're really wet, you fucking bitch, you try. Yeah, see, he went right behind it. Yeah, bro. right up in there. Went that right door. behind it. Put two seeds up in. Honestly, bro, if the apocalypse came and my wife presumes I'm dead, right? My bro goes and saves my woman and my son, and he holds them down this entire time. If she didn't at least suck your dick, my nigga, like, that's an ungrateful ass <laughs> bitch. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we gonna, me and her gonna have a talk. Like, look, look. <laughs> I know Kane held y'all down, you know. Check it out. Look. Did you get that nigga straight, man? Because he looks stressed oh, out. Oh, shit. You ain't get that man straight. You saved your fucking life. <laughs> you thought I was there. What do you want? You were waiting for me? You fucking idiot. Suck his dick now, and this is over. All right, and you come back and damn, you know, each other forever. Man, desperate times. I start sharing shit. That's nigga, real. You're my brothers. Like, yo, oh, we're living. <laughs> you, if you feeding me, yeah. I'm feeding you, nigga. Yeah. Hey, hey, look, you saved off. their life and my son, my nigga. Nah, you just nah. Step that person. Same you. scenario though. Got yeah. to share that. If you came back and she was fucking him. Mm-hmm. Would you take her back or would you let him have her? How long? Have oh, no, nah, this is my pussy? family. No, nah, I'm back. And this is my family. You're taking that back? No, nah, this is my family. I'm what back, I nigga. Have? Y'all thought I was dead, <laughs> but I'm not. Here the fuck I am. This is my family. You got me fucked up. Still your boy. Yeah, it's still my still nigga. It's a zombie apocalypse. But you see, all where, bets are you all. see where Shane took it, though. You see where Shane fucked out. She was up in the woods like. <laughs> Shane couldn't just had had his fun and been an appropriate sad nigga. Right. And I get it, because I've been that sad nigga. And I've wanted to just call a nigga up and be like, bro, let me come to you like a man. <laughs> and, 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 and shame the whole situation. Oh, Bitch, if I can't have you, you know what I'm saying? Like... <laughs> But I never did it. I never did it because I, I can't fight that well, nigga. Like, I can protect myself, but the niggas that these bitches was fucking with, I was not winning those fights. So, Dang. I was not coming to them like, man, fuck that. I'm your pocket. I'm coming to you. I'm going to dab you up like a bitch. Like, hey, bro, my man. <laughs> yeah, he don't know. He don't know. <laughs> Why fuck up a good thing? Yo, I know. Yo, I yeah, yeah, like I said, I'm looking for some niggas, man, because I just feel like that shit coming. And then my cousin just posted some shit that really just gave me my um, PSTD, my PS, what is it? One of those PSTD. Um, PSTD. 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 Um, that shit fucked me up because it was like, <coughs> we, we have a zombie apocalypse. Right. Uh, uh, survival kit. Yeah. You need to learn how to, you know, for a zombie. I had a whole article yeah. on it. I'm like, what the fuck is this? You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. Yeah, I, I get to reading shit on Facebook too, so you never fuck. You get paranoid? Yeah, man, it's coming, man. Real niggas I think the about COVID was the was yeah. The, real niggas think about this every day, yo. Yeah. Seriously, like real niggas I think the today. COVID was. I just wake up and I'm like, today's the day that zombies are gonna take over the world. I need to be prepared. And then my aunt, she just be telling me shit like. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes she be, you know, talking yeah. about aliens and crazy shit, though. But sometimes she be like, yeah, see, I told you. Mm. Mm. I told you when, fucking, what's the name? Um, COVID happened. That's why I'm trying to get home. Mm. I want to be home when this shit happened. Mm. 2021, something mm. else coming. I take it. I was mm. like, oh, fuck. <laughs> she sounds like my kind of lady, man. Yeah. So I, I listen. Auntie, I, yeah. Yeah. She she auntie, auntie. Yeah. I listen to her like, mm, okay. She be knowing. She knows something that I don't know. That's all I know. I like that, man. You've been doing your homework, y'all. I like this, y'all. This is, this is, this is I did a little it's bit. It's a lot smoother than I thought it was, bro. 
We just so like, me and this guy get to get yo. Know, we so cool because right. we just you know laid back. I know he'll be dope. Be like. All right. Right. You know what I'm saying? So we just a good time. Right. Everybody's a good time. You the same motherfucking personality, that vibe, man. Yeah. Like I be telling just, motherfuckers about they vibe, like yeah. your energy is just fucked up. Yeah. You know? I know like shit could be you know worse, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I seen niggas with leukemia and shit, niggas yeah. with cancer and shit. Yeah, yeah, it could be way more fucking worse, you know what I'm saying? That's so, a fact. That's a fact. It's a, yeah. I mean, some people can't help that shit, man. You do, honestly at the end of the day, you just got to be happy that you you're born unique. Cuz a lot of motherfuckers not, yo. Some motherfuckers is just like slow, bro. Like they don't get the fact that, you know what I'm saying? I don't know why I want to smoke But like uh, It's a lot of people That don't really get the fact That you know what I mean Life Is beautiful bro Like Life is precious my nigga It's, it's such a, Like it really literally Wake up and smell the fucking roses nigga. Like life is truly beautiful But Of course it, Are there You know Issues with it And it's fucking life bro It wouldn't be life without it you know what I'm saying? Right. Hard times are coming, nigga. Yeah. Like, relax, nigga. Like, you can get through that shit. I got a motherfucking license, my nigga. I got more than hundred dollars in my bank account, and I'm STD free, nigga. Anything's possible. I think that come from like just niggas like that's been raised like in Tiffin Page and respect. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All them Jones, first yeah. street. Yeah, yeah. Niggas already prepared for adversity. Right. He was raised for that shit. Right. Born for that shit. Right. And even as a, as a, back in the slavery days, you know what I'm saying? It comes from generations and generations. The ones that it is, then the house niggas, they be going motherfucking crazy, nigga. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Identity oh, crisis. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. I get it. At the same time, you got to you gotta take the good with the bad, bro. At all times, man, because... Shit could be a lot fucking worse, man. And um, I know niggas that grew up in negative environments. And, you know, I feel like I grew up in a negative environment, even though, you know, my mom did her best. Uh, it was shit she just couldn't protect me from. Man, you know what I'm saying? In the 90s, and yeah. shit was crazy. It was just everywhere. Like, she, she would have had crazy. to just kept me in the house, and there was no way she could do that. So, it, it just, you know, but I don't think we knew about chakras. We didn't know about vibes and, you know, putting positive shit in the air and, 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 and you know, actually thinking positive, having a positive mind. We weren't taught that shit. Right. It was if somebody put their hands on you, beat their motherfucking ass. And that was our lesson in life, my nigga. Like, that was it. <laughs> like, right. it wasn't even, nigga, look both ways when you cross the street. Like, good luck out there. If anybody hits you, though, hit their ass back. Always. Good luck, little black king. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Both ways when you cross the street. Yeah, like, so, you know, man. It is what it is. But, you know, niggas like us, man, we breaking generational curses because we come from generations of niggas that had good ideas. And they was just that good ideas. They didn't go for it. This is you taking a good idea and making it better, putting it into fruitation, my nigga. We doing this right here. You look at your equipment right now. You gonna look back ten years, nigga. Like, oh, remember the setup, the right. whole setup, my nigga. God damn, how the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? That's really what this shit is all about, bro. Like, progress, my nigga. Oh yeah. And to that, I was just gonna ask you too, like. You know, you transitioned from radio into like podcasting, like Chris Newman's show, like VA Doe with Do uh Do Man Network, like motherfucking I thought what's the name was coming? Um seven hundred quails, yo. Yeah, shit. yeah. Uh we don't hang out outside of the podcast because we really don't fuck with each other. Like, <laughs> oh, okay. So <laughs> I, if I, I like if this nigga would have came what would we talk about in the car, like Oh business is business. Uh, uh, nigga, how's the ghetto? <laughs> like, I don't know, how are fat bitches? I mean, it just would be an awkward car ride. Right? Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> nah, that's my nigga. Shout out to 700 uh, Quills. <laughs> <laughs> People really don't know. People are like, yo, I thought y'all niggas really don't like each other. I'm like, we don't. The <laughs> fuck? <laughs> that's how it works. That's the dynamic. That's what makes us work. Um, right. You know. But, um, yeah, it's, it was a transition, but it was something. It was a good idea. You know, uh, Doe Man has been my partner since the boom box. I asked him to come help me. I knew he was good with the camera. I knew he was a master at production. I knew he was a master at promotion. And I saw 
what was about to I saw what he is now back then. You know what I'm saying? I could tell what he was saying back then. A lot of people didn't get him at that time. Uh, he used to rap and he had this own specific rap voice. And a lot of motherfuckers don't like, like what was that for the fuck was that voice? It was so he stood out. Like he had a reason as to why he did everything. And uh, I saw that real early in the game and I was like, I I can't do this by myself. I could say that a million times, yes. This is the Chris Newman show, da 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 da. But it takes a production team to do a show. I can't. I'm just stood. I'm just a nigga. They push in front of the camera and Son, start talking. I'm telling you, yeah. it's hard for me. You see me yeah. fuck going on yeah. here. This little bullshit I got going on right here. That shit. Yeah. Editing and all that shit. That shit take a lot out of me. So yeah. I definitely respect y'all, Chris yeah. Newman, um, yeah. and um, the Dope Boy Network and um, yeah. 700 y'all, what y'all do, cause. Like this shit is it, it, it's easy, but like a lot of this shit behind it behind scenes, the scenes, it's, it's not uh, as easy as it looks, but yeah. it is. Cause we just shoot the shit, bro. Yeah, 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 we could yeah, yeah. be at a pool hall doing the same yeah, shit, but yeah. that you know that's I wasn't even gonna bring no questions, just, oh, you know, yeah. cause you know how we do. We just fucking yeah. talking like I like that shit though. I like but, uh, it though. I like being put in the. I wanna try it. I wanna try it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Keep it coming. Man. Man. Keep it coming. I might got some more. Let me see. All right. Well, we did this one last week. Let's try this one. Um. Could you let a woman run the household and pay all the bills? Yes. Okay. So stay the whole day. Yes. Whatever she wants, I'll do it. What do you want? Like, it's a, it's it's a, <laughs> it's a difference though. You gotta understand. I've been that boyfriend before, but it wasn't like a happy relationship. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, if I really was wife and kids. And her ass is like getting Oprah money. I have nothing to fucking say to that. <laughs> what the fuck do you want me to do? Like, of course I'm gonna be like, yo, babe, you know, help me with my dreams. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah. I'm a I'm a go get a nigga anyway. I do want my own. Yeah. But okay. if we talking Oprah bread. Do I really gotta do all this shit? Like the the point was, what if we not talking Oprah bread? We talking right. a woman, and let's just say you making, you know, let's just say hypothetically, hypothetically, you making thirty thousand. Right. She's making a hundred and twenty. No, she's making. No, I ain't gonna go that high. Let's go to seventy five thousand. Seventy five you know grand. Seventy five, eighty thousand. You know what I'm saying? I was still, I was still trying to find a way that we both could work. And, and, and both pull our weight You know yeah. what I'm saying Make this an equal thing I want her to know that I got your back You know what I'm saying Like even though you bringing in the bread I can't do nothing about that right. My girl make more money than me now Thing about that is She's very secretive about her money I don't know what they this all about. are she, they will all not, like, she does not like tell me Like how much she makes But I know she makes a lot right. So it's like Hey what the fuck is that about yeah, But it's all good it's Because cool. I, it, you know, just naturally as a man, I do feel like I'm a provider. I feel like I'm a protector. I feel like I'm a, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm all these things that I need to be in the household, especially if we got kids in the house. Right. I have to show some type of fucking balls here. Like, right. You know what I'm saying? Right. If I ain't paying no fucking bills. So on that, no, so are you so my, you cool? My opinion is historically there's always been a difference between between like men and women right now if you want to go to work uh. and make the money that's all right but our relationship and how we run the house is what we need to make sure we're, we're good on right. clear on right clear on yeah. you know what i mean money balance you know whatever if you got that if you got that and we're living it you know what i mean you take care of that <laughs> this shit's gonna be taken care of but how we run this house, how we raise these kids, right? We might need to be clear about that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, what you bring to the table, what am I bringing to the table, and right. what are we doing together? Okay, I like that. Straight. Yeah. Draw the lines in the sand. Yeah, I, like you know what I mean, so hey. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean, because if I need to make the money, I do what I can. Do what you can. Let's do what we can. But in the house. I think my voice needs to be heard and say that's it if I need to. Yes, sir. In retrospect, right? if my girl was making Oprah money, I'm definitely cheating. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's enough money to cheat, my nigga. I don't give a fuck. Like, I'm gonna fuck the shit out you, Oprah. If she can find out you cheated. Yeah, that's cool. She got that disappear money. You I can't have it. I can live with that. 
I get half. Yeah. No, no, he yeah. ain't get half. If, Yo, if, if they're married, dog. This nigga's my lawyer, nigga. I'm getting half. You heard what the fuck he <laughs> said? Man, I need Sorry, fun. Sorry, man, but. This is what we agreed on, man. We Until death to us part, I need oh. half. <laughs> I nigga, I need right. to maintain my life. Oh, my God. <laughs> that's what they always say. Uh, Come on. Gotta maintain the lifestyle. Yeah. It ain't a one ray river no more. Nowadays, <laughs> women <laughs> rights, yo, I, brother need help. Huh? Okay. <laughs> that made dang going in. Huh? <laughs> hey. And the sauce right. Saucy. Um, five down. years from now, uh -huh. what do you see yourself and the podcast? Uh, five years from now, man. Um, I wanna, I wanna. The Christian Woman shows twenty four hours a day, and unfortunately for me, right? Um, it's some shit that is in embedded in me. You know what I'm saying? I've been this character my entire life. Everybody that knows me have known me. I've done something fucking dumb as shit to earn their like for them to remember me for fucking ever, right? Uh, I.e. niggas think I'm dry kick, kicking bitches. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> like, um, I really want this shit to go to a level where, you know, um, I can inspire more people to take that leap. You know what I'm saying? I feel like sometimes I'm so rambunctious and I'm so overly me. It's kind of make niggas be like... See man, I'm just gonna do a podcast, man. But this nigga Chris Newman doing a podcast. I don't want niggas think I'm doing a podcast. The Chris Newman doing a podcast. And now they done th totally thought themselves yeah, out of it. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I know I do this shit because you know I'm a little guy, man. I don't know how to fucking play ball, my nigga. Like I'm not good at many things. So the shit that I am good at. I'm good at that shit. You feel what I'm saying? Right. So it's not to like make another nigga fall huh? back. It's really I really want to see uh niggas excel, and hopefully within the next five years, man, we can show the world with uh what Charlottesville knew all along, and that's that I am a motherfucking superstar. Yes, sir. <laughs> that's all I'm saying. You heard it. Like, like a motherfucking superstar. They go like that's what. I want. Like I said, I, I, I see you throughout the years. Yeah. Years. This is yeah, like, dude. you know, 10 years or more. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Online. Yeah. And I was like, yo, who the fuck is that? This <laughs> man with niggas be like, yo, you don't know Chris Newman. I was yeah. like, no. Nah, <laughs> That's weird, yo. Yeah. Nah. No. That's He's weird, like, yo. God, I won't be out. That's weird. I'm going to be honest yeah. with you, yo. Um, When I was watching y'all do like y'all little pilot, like y'all little test run. Right. And I was like, oh, the fuck we got here? Because I already knew this nigga was a funny nigga, right? Yeah. I thought you was CLS at first. I'm going to keep it a buck. <laughs> I was like, CLS. They can't never tell us apart. CLS getting some weight. It looks good on him. All right, yes, CLS. Sir. Good good for you. Whatever. All right, let's check this out. What we have going on here. And I remember when uh, uh, you were like, yo, yo, what the fuck are we calling this? Somebody said, real quick, real shit, deal with it. And my nigga was like, for real? That's what we call it? Yeah, nigga. That's the name of it. Ari, I'm just saying it's a lot of syllables. Real quick, bro, shit that way. No, like, Ari, man. And I was like, yo, I fucking love yes, it, bro. Sir. And then, like, you know, I was peeping. I was like, well, this is my opportunity to really show that I'm encouraging this shit because it is, this shit is like, the gold rush back in California, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. it's a untapped territory that nobody really knows how to really manage it. Right. It's just everywhere and it's possible for everyone. Everyone has their own specific shit. You could do a gospel joint. Uh, my niggas is doing a joint for dogs. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, even cat people gonna watch that yeah. shit. You see what I'm saying? It's like, it's a, it's, Enough room for everybody yep. to eat, bro. Sure. Like the way that y'all do more of an improv thing, you know what I'm saying? Y'all right. do it live, y'all right here. Y'all niggas like, hey man, I remember the first time bitch tried to leave my butt. <laughs> and like, <laughs> and like that shit is just like it just flows, my nigga. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I like how God Appreciate cast, you, how, 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 how God cast. Gets in debt with people. Like, they yeah, really yeah. dig into your fucking soul. Like, yo, what do you really feel about these issues? 
My shit is like fucking Tom Green, nigga. I don't yeah, know what the yeah, fuck I'm yeah, doing. Yeah, yeah. I'm just doing it. And I got Quills. He's the smartest dumb nigga in the world. Dumb man owns expensive cameras. It's lit, nigga. Yeah, Cause the crazy no. thing is like, I don't even know like if you like that too. Yeah, you on episode 20, but how many episodes did you really feel? We filmed, we, we on episode nine or some shit like mm-hmm. that. But we really filmed maybe about 20. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that. Uh, we just trying to, you know what I'm saying, yeah. fill that shit out. Yeah. We yeah. try We try to shoot in advance. Yeah. We try to have like three, four, maybe five episodes in, in advance. The top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Dome Man pr- stays pretty busy yeah. editing that shit. Like, honestly, bro, that nigga does all fucking work, bro. Yeah. Anything that involves how good it looks yeah. is because of Dome. Yeah, like, you know what amazing. I'm saying? Um... I don't know how he does it, bro. Like, honestly, because I'm sick of my, the sound of my own voice. This nigga has to hear this shit every week and, like, really just really listen to it. He has no choice but to listen to all the stupid shit I have that to fucking say. see the vision. Yeah, yeah. And, the, like, and, and I know he does because why else would he deal with me, bro? I know I get on this nigga's fucking nerves. Right. Like, I know this nigga's... Can you tell this, me how many people... That's what my career is now. <laughs> I'm wondering how big his production team is and what it takes. Uh, it's just three of us. It's three of you guys? It's just three of us. We got one tech guy. I got uh, one guy that does a lot of research and gives a lot of topics. And then there's me. Just Yeah, that shit is there. really nice. Mm-hmm. Like, the production is just... Yeah. One guy who edits? Yeah. Films, edits, cuts, throws in the fucking promotional videos it's uncanny bro i've never seen no shit like that in my life. questions like how many hours do you guys spend recording how many how many hours are spent editing to produce something like that <sighs> editing you 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 talking to the wrong guy but i assume <laughs> it takes a long fucking time because he's yeah. got two cameras like this but it's like more like uh when i'm talking the camera's on me then it cuts to him and I'll interrupt the fuck out of you and then he'll come back with it and then it's like this. So he has to like do that shit all day. Like yeah. it's a uh it's a process, yo. I'm sure. I'm sure. Um I got some um things I'm gonna be doing up north. So, you know, uh production on Chris Newman podcast is gonna be a little bit slower. Um, you know, the episodes might slow down a little bit, but um this is this is my team, man, and these are my partners. And um, if I gotta go do some interning or what, the, whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying, to bring my niggas with me, I'm down to do that shit. You know what I mean? Right. And uh, that's that's pretty much where we at right now with this shit, man. Let's try to take this shit to the top, pull all the stops. I told my job, suck my dick. You know, I told my girl like, hey, you know, uh, I love you. You know, if. You know, you start seeing other people, I get it. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? I had to talk. Um, oh, I'm, I'm, but I'm about to, you know, oh, it's only so much the Ville can do for me, dog. Yeah. I love it here. Trust me, man. Like I said, me, baby James, bro, it's only us, the kings <laughs> of the Ville, my nigga. Yeah. But I, I'm at a glass ceiling right now. You ain't putting Denzi in from the block up in there? You know, Denzi, mm-hmm. Denzi's in there. But see, Denzi. <laughs> <laughs> Denzi has his own uh, Mount Olymp- Olympus of Denzi, 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 Denzi. Right. Like, nigga, we just the mon- we just monuments over here. Me and Baby James are monuments. This nigga's the real fucking deal. <laughs> yeah. He, I build the city up. He fucks the city. Yeah. Up. It's, it's a it's a it's a give and take situation. And shout out to my boy Denzi, man. Um, I need to get yes, him on the show. The hell, yeah. Bro. Yeah. So it's super impressive that you hit a ceiling mm-hmm. and you're going other places. Yeah. But at the same time, you don't worry about competition or anything else and you want to help yeah. the industry. Yeah. And are here to talk and explain the way it go- the industry is. Yeah. And grow. Right. Yeah. yeah. And you're never going to be leaving Seville if you're pulling Seville up with you. Right. That's right, like, you know, and that's that's the way I see it. Right. looking at this. It's a it's a yeah. it's a, it's a, it's a different. It's a, honestly, bro, you gotta lead by example. You gotta show somebody something they never seen before before you can try to convince them otherwise. 
Uh, that's that's the hardest part though because you'll run into somebody every day that'll talk a good game. You know what I'm saying? But to yeah. actually put that shit into fruition and watch it manifest into something extraordinary, honestly, um, that shit's rare. And I think that's how it's got to be done. Um, they'll call us crabs in, in, in a bucket, but they won't think about the fact that. Crabs were never born in buckets. They weren't supposed to be there in the first fucking place. You know what I'm saying? Like that's how I look at it. Oh, that's and crazy. that's that's how you know what I'm saying. That's, that's how real quick real shit. Deal with real, 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 real shit. Deal with that shit. <laughs> so to help, to help, and everything else, but to help pull up. You know what I mean? To be here, extend that. You know, yeah. to to everybody and explain that. You know, yeah. and what it takes and yeah. what it is. Yeah. And keep pulling as you grow. Yeah. Is a is a very admirable thing for you to do as you as you have opportunities definitely to grow yes, definitely. definitely we appreciate you definitely that's yes. that's the beauty of it man yeah. not- reach one teach one man what the fuck like it's really no niggas know I, the niggas I don't like know I don't fucking like them you like you know what I'm saying like yeah. it's not no niggas that. I actually am behind them like, yo, bravo, I saw what you did, that shit was impressive, like, you know what I'm saying, it's no niggas that I would do that for that I don't fucking fuck with, like, you know what I mean, so, if you black, and you trying to do something positive, bro, and that shit gonna push you and your family and your goals forward, I'm all for that shit, all day, all day, for sure, one love, yeah, man, man, that's some real shit right there, dude, bro, son, yeah, we put your shit on right here. Uh, I watch, the last episode I just watched was the Barber's Den. That joint was lit. Oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, that that's whole, a good one. Uh, I like that scenario he got going on for yeah. his uh, for his, his barber his shop. Barber shop you yeah. Know what I'm yeah, I like to see that joint, and it's right around the corner. So I can, yeah, shoot, shoot. Where yeah, is it? yeah. He gonna put a joint by Marshalls. Yeah, who's that? In that shopping center. It's a barber shop. Yeah, that's where Ray's going. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Isn't I think he, yeah, yeah, he's doing uh, construction yeah. now on it. Damn. Yeah. yeah. That's lit, man. That's what, what it's about, about, man. Build, build right. Black Seaville, man. You know? Yeah, I'm trying to get some businesses out here, too. Move forward, man. Let's see what else we got on here on the list. All right, answer it up. We already got all that one. Where did you grow up? I already got all that one. See yourself in five years. <laughs> You know, Zombie apocalypse. <laughs> you know, you know, you can you you can silently read that. Right? Yeah, <laughs> I just wanted to make sure y'all did. Yeah. You know what we did do? We kind of just dove straight into the questions. We never yeah. had a smoke break. Never yeah. had a smoke break. We yeah. had a smoke smoke break. We were smoking. Like well, our smoke break go. was going we, to smoke break. We never asked you what is it currently that you're listening to, uh-huh. you're watching, mm-hmm. the movies or whatever. Mm-hmm. Uh, currently listening to anything Griselda. I am such a big fan of Conway, of uh, Benny, Westside Gun. They remind me of 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 me and my crew growing up, man. And they they got they shot, and them niggas are spitting bars like I miss gritty, grimy. Them niggas look like they ain't changed their clothes in weeks. <laughs> Hip hop. I miss that shit, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, Wu Tang where I started, that. so it's like I, I I miss that shit. So uh, I'm really listening to that. Anything, anything Griselda. Um, what I'm watching other than porn. Boom, um, boom, boom, boom. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I'm I'm definitely in the Snowfall. Snowfall is my shit. Oh, yeah, um, I ain't watched it this week. Yeah, yeah. Snowfall gets really good. I need to get on that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you haven't watched it. I should fucking drop mad spoilers just to disrespect you for not watching it. That's what I did to my best friend. He said he never watched it. I just started dropping spoilers. Fuck you. You You couldn't ruin it. How dare you just now? What the fuck have you been watching? Definitely could ruin it for me. I need to see it for myself. Lord of the Rings trilogies we've been been watching. Fucking asshole. No, I'm just fucking. No, like, uh, yeah, that's what I'm. uh, uh, What else was the question? I'm watching. Oh, no. Yeah, like TV shows, movies. Yeah, because we need something, man. We've been stuck in the house. You movies? know what I'm saying, motherfuckers in COVID. Movies suck, dog. 
Like all movies suck. Nigga, coming to weird. America came out, what, tomorrow? Coming out tomorrow or, on Amazon? Uh, really I'm not that. looking forward to that, Man, shit, that shit, bro. It's been 29 years, dog. I don't give a fuck anymore. Do not watch. recycle any. If they do this movie, they better not recycle not one fucking joke. <laughs> I swear <laughs> to God, bro. They better. You know how sequels do, and they like give you a remembrance yeah, of, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. so yeah, yeah, yeah. so sad. But like years later, yeah, and it's like, a nigga yeah, with yeah, yeah. Don't <laughs> spin off not one fucking joke, all right? It's fucking Arsenio Hall, oh, fucking man. Eddie fucking Murphy. You are fucking comic legends. Do not reuse anything. Like, do it. I know the characters are back. I get it. But don't. You know what I mean? Don't recycle any of those fucking jokes. Because I'm going to be pissed off. You just made me want to watch it even more. Like, when you brought up some of that shit. Yeah. Like, what Classic. Like, come on. Bro. Yeah. 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 Yeah, Friday got a couple more years. So I'm like, man, I don't, I don't care no more. I don't He's care, bro. I'm kind of already there. With yeah. Friday. Pops ain't going to be there. What the fuck are we doing this it's movie over. for? Shut down production. It's, it's over. over. I don't even care what Chris Tucker's doing down there. It's like, they they just... They, <laughs> They didn't just at me like, you know what, Chris Tucker, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> fuck you. Yeah, Rush Hour 5. Yeah, yeah don't do Rush Hour 5, you piece of shit. <laughs> no, no funny money. Too young is fucking. Yeah. Got gray hair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um. Yeah, yeah. man, that's me in a nutshell. Well, man. Man. Yeah, I think we, yeah. I think we unlocked. Now I think I know who Chris Newman is. Thank I know you, man. who V.E. Doe is. Yeah, you know nice to meet you, man. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you, man. Very, yeah. really nice to meet yeah. you. Nice to meet you, too, man. You you seem like a pretty good guy, man. That's some damn man. long yeah, fingers, man. man. Yeah, yeah, I do, man. What's up with your fingers? It's for finger and fat bitches. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you better eat. I can get up eating. under them rolls with that joint. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. Start eating, man. You need some girth on them. Yeah, nah. Oh, shit. Pause. Pause. This shit is long, this, son. This is when I leave. <laughs> All right, y'all. Right. This is when I get the fuck out. Yeah, hey, <laughs> let's do it. Hey, this is real quick, real shit. Deal with. Deal with it. We had Chris Newman and had VA Doe. Yeah. Yeah. Chris Newman yeah. Show. Yeah. Chris yeah. Newman yeah. Show. Thanks for having me, man. This is no dope. Hey, thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. I'll be sure to tag myself. Yeah, you yeah, do that. Yeah, get this guy the fuck out of here. Come on. All right, man. Yeah. All right, man. Peace.